sing it three more times. Oh, how daunting. Let it fall on me. Fall on me. Say, Lord, oh, how daunting. Let it fall on me. Just pray for yourself that God will stir up something inside of you. Whatever tiny little spirit, power, residual grace that he has inside of you, may he stir it up today. May he stir it up today. So that during the anointing, as it all falls on your head, it will activate something powerful, something divine, something supernatural. Oh God Almighty, do it, do it, do it, do it. Father, activate something powerful, something divine, something supernatural, oh God. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I pray today, make me needed, make me useful, make me needed, oh God. Make it impossible for me to be ignored. Father, make it impossible for me to be ignored. I pray, oh God Almighty, may I be useful. May I be useful. May I be useful. May the anointing of God release grace upon me. May I be useful this morning, oh God. As I go out of this place, may I be useful. May the anointing make me needed and useful. Heavenly Father, I ask you today, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, oh God Almighty, I ask you, Heavenly Father, thank you, O oh God. Father, we pray this morning, as we go through this ordinance, we ask you that you will carry out a work that is supernatural, a work that is powerful, a work that is transformational. On the day David was anointed, you anointed him in the presence of his enemies. And his life never remained the same. Father, as we anoint this morning, I ask you that every burden will be lifted up. Every yoke will be destroyed. People will enter their destiny today in the name of Jesus Christ. I ask you that the anointing will bring healing. The anointing will bring wholeness. The anointing will bring completeness in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 
So, um, Pastor Informa, you will stay on this side. And then, Pastor, three of you will go to the other side. That could ever come close. Nothing can compare. You're our living home. Yeah. Your presence, Lord. Said I've tested. I've tested and seen of the sweetness of love. The sweetness of love. When my heart becomes free. My heart becomes free. And my shame is unknown. Yeah. Yeah.
Father, we thank you today. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you. Thank you for what you alone can do, O God. We worship you. We exalt your holy name. You are the almighty God. We declare that in this place, this is a new day. Father, this is a new beginning. We declare that in this place, new doors are opened. We declare that in this place, there's a bridge from the old to the new. From the new to newer. From ground zero to ground glory. We declare that in this place, there's a bridge from lack to abundance. From poverty to wealth. From shame to glory. From, restor from, 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 from that which has been lost to restoration. Father, we declare that in this place there's a bridge from sickness to health in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, in this place there's honor. There's honor. Honor upon your people. Honor upon your people. Honor upon your people in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Hallelujah. Let the people of God say good amen. Put us hands together for the Lord. Okay. Um, let me just make this announcement before we... Um, please, remember I said on Wednesday we start fasting through to Friday, through Saturday. On Friday we have a prayer meeting here where we'll be anointing everybody. No, did I say anointing? Holy communion. <laughs> Holy communion service. And I'll pray with you with a handkerchief as the way you give. And then um, there are some people who have been donating things for, you know, this stage was donated by somebody. And uh, some people have bought chairs and bought microphones and other things. So I think I should let you know because at the workers' meeting they were saying, the Pastor, why don't you let us know the things that people that we need? As a church, please, in case there's anything you want to do, the children's church, we want to furnish it. We still want to get more chairs. We want to get a screen, a projector, digital screen. You know, uh, some people have volunteered to get us a podium. So we're going to be ordering a podium that we'll be using. Hopefully, if it gets here by Easter, we'll use it. If we don't get it by Easter, the women's will use, be the first people to use it. You know, so in case you want to donate any of those things, please feel free to let us know, and uh, we'll put your money to good use. Amen. Amen. The blue envelopes, please, as you give your offerings, remember the blue envelopes. If you don't have a blue envelope, raise up your hand. If you don't have a blue envelope, raise up your hand. <laughs> okay. So we're going to take our offering. Now, if you have your tithe, you want to bring your tithe, come up, let me pray with you. I want to introduce Pastor Shinawa. He's here with his wife. Please, next time you come, sit in the front. There are pastors in our parish in, in uh, Ikeja, you know, so honor to whom honor is due. Go ahead and clap if you want to clap. You know, he comes in here every now, him and his wife, they sit at the back somewhere. Ushers, if you see any of them sitting at the back, 